blame as the investigation continues into the Albuquerque Police Department's DWI unit. Tonight, three city councilors asked Chief Harold Medina to make an appearance to answer questions about APD's involvement in this investigation. Well, this Munoz is live from the meeting to show us what the chief said. Yeah, Shelly and Doug, as requested, Chief Medina did come to the council meeting tonight and residents we spoke to say they're happy about it. That court notice, whether it's one or ten, could be dealt with as, as internal polling officers and counselors. Chief asked to meet the counselors for an executive closed meeting, but decided to show up tonight to address questions from the council. I'm excited that he, he came to, you know, to, to represent himself. But, but it's yeah. nice to know that he's here and that he's willing to cooperate. And Teresa Garcia lives here in the South Valley, and she came to tonight's meeting for answers. Chief Medina said during a press conference that they're looking into five officers not showing up for court. The DA also dropped over 100 DWI cases last month involving those officers. I know this is this is centered around DWI, but I'm also concerned about all the domestic violence cases and sexual assault cases that also are not addressed with police officers not attending court cases. So does it go beyond that is my question and how we're addressing to make sure that that officers are being held accountable to go to court. During the meeting, Counselor Sanchez, one who took part in writing a letter to the chief and has a background as a police officer, says he doesn't understand how the police department didn't catch the sooner. Know who's missing court, who isn't missing court. It's not the responsibility of the DA's office. It's not the responsibility of the individual. It's not the responsibility of the citizens who are out here. It's your responsibility. Both two city counselors that were former police officers, every officer knows that over the past 20 years, we've received his photos from the courts, I mean from the district attorney's office. KOAT check with prior mayoral and police administrations dating back to 2005 and before Keller took office, police chiefs customarily attended every city council meeting.